Short Circuit is not a film with deep hidden meanings, and whilst there are some moral messages within the film, they're just minor distractions from the main theme of the film. What the film is, is a complete and utter romp. Turn your critical mind off, kick back and enjoy the ride. Also, don't expect any stellar acting performances from the likes of Steve Guttenberg or G.W. Bailey, both who march through the film like they're back at Police Academy. Ali Sheedy does put in a credible performance as Stephanie, but she, like all the other actors, has her scenes completely and utterly stolen from her by number five, the robot who is short-circuited by a lightning strike which makes Number five, Alive, something which he tells people on numerous occasions. Number five himself is one of five robots built by the military and equipped with a powerful laser weapon. Number five, after being struck by lightning, goes walkabout trying to discover information about life, or he refers to it, input. Through various twists and turns in the story, Everything turns out all right for Number 5 and his friends. However, this is all just an excuse for Number 5 to seal as many scenes and probably a heart at the same time. From reprogramming other robots to enact a scene from the Three Stooges to disco dancing and charging to the rescue, Number 5 is at the heart of everything in this film but it's the dialogue that will probably win you over. Um, the best example is probably when grasping somebody else's gun, crushing it, he delivers the lines, Colt, 45, semi-automatic, play doll. This film was good enough to warrant the studio to make a sequel, but it didn't quite capture the magic of the original, which will always be worth watch, no matter what age you are or who you are. It's a wonderful film to watch.